I'm currently using Unity version 2021.2.2 F1. Let's start by creating a tree object. Now on the inspector click the branch. By adding frequency you can multiply the number of branches you can have. The growth scale changes the scale of the branches. Growth angle rotates branches. Another way to add branches is by adding a branch group. Group seed changes the position where your branch is connected. Right now I'm happy with how the branch looks like, so let's another branch. Just like what we did before, just adjust the group angle, group scale, frequency, and growth seed. Just keep adding branches. Let's add some leaves. Choose one of the end branches, and click add leaf group. The leaf group has the same settings as branches. Frequency adds more leaves. Growth angle changes the rotation. Growth scale changes the size. And growth seed changes the positioning of the leaves. Also if you want you can add more leaves to other branches, just simply choose one of the other branches and add a leaf group. Let me adjust the lights first, so we can see the color more. That's better. Now let's make the leaves look more like a leaf, to do that we need to create a material and texture. I made this leaf texture, you can create your own texture on any art or photo editor you want, but you can also get this texture, the link is in the description. These are the settings for the texture, I did not change anything, other than the max size and turn on compress. Now create a material. I will name it leaf. Now change the shader to nature. Tree creator leaves. On the base texture select your leaf texture. Next, go back to your tree game object, and assign your leaf material, to each leaf group that you have. You can also make a material for the branches. Use tree creator bark under nature, on the shader option. Lastly, we are going to add some wind. To create a wind zone, simply select either a branch or leaf group. Scroll down, and under the wind, click create wind zone. Now our tree has a wind effect. To change the wind effect, select either a branch or leaf group, and adjust the settings under wind. Do not mind the error. It happens when you adjust settings on play. You can also change the color, and adjust the shadow. Now on your project file find your tree, if your tree doesn't have the leaves, double click to open the prefab, and in the inspector click the small refresh button. Now let's try putting it on a terrain. Create a terrain. Go to paint trees. Edit trees. And add tree. Assign the tree that we just created then add. and start painting your trees.
That is all for this video. The project file is in the description for free, thank you for watching.